Hi, I'm uh, Isha, I'm Puck's sister. <laughs> yeah, I'm here to, mainly to support her, but also, but also do her Instagram reels. Uh, that would be amazing. Like last year when it was in America, I was watching it on TV and it, it was like crazy. But now, because it's the elite world champions, I think it's going to be even more euphoric and crazy. Also because it's so, it's going to be, it's it's going to, not going to be easy because Fem is also really good. So. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is Anna Kane. I'm a mom, Hayley. Yeah, Hello. really nervous. I'm trying to take Anna's nerves off her and take them away from her. And I'll take them. <laughs> She's, there's no pressure on her today. She's just coming back from a broken finger. Um, so she's just going to go out there and really enjoy it. Um, especially after yesterday, um, doing the relay. So she's just going to enjoy it today. I think for you it's understanding what your portions are as well know. and knowing what that is. They can tell you grams or percentages or whatever you want to know. Right, I'm going to ride up and down. See you in a bit. Yeah. Enjoy your little ride up and down. I will. Best, best shot at having any chance is getting over on the right. Far, far and, right. And just, just keep pushing through. Keep pushing through. Okay. They swing over. You push. Runs attention. Ten minutes left before the start. Hello. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. ready for the biggest race of their cyclical season they are representing 14 different countries the winst daar maar zeker van de inzet is de regenbochtre is de gouden medaille en die willen ze uiteraard allemaal graag straks Who will be crowned as new world champion in the women elite category? One more minute before the start. Ongar, one minute before the départ. The best of luck, ladies. Bonne chance. Heel veel succes gewenst.
schepje bij schepje bij, fan van Hempel. Ja, die ga je uiteindelijk doorvoelen in de kuiten. so many people in the race uh, at the race so uh, yeah very special for me and uh, yeah it was a it was a battle with Puck uh, I think she crashed or uh, she made a fall but uh, at that moment I go full gas and uh, yeah uh, yeah I, 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 it's difficult to find the right words so uh, it's a bit emotional yeah I'm just happy to be back racing uh, I was pretty nervous at the start um, my mom was there to take all my stress um, and just talk to people. So, um, but yeah, I was just happy to be stood on the start line again. There's three more weeks left of the season, so I'm just going to race everything that I can. Um, I had a yeah a month out, so just yeah as much cyclocross racing as I can before the season ends. What a race, what a championship and what a podium. Congratulations to our medal winners. How did you feel out there during the racing? It was really, really hard race uh, and really, really, really long. So yeah, it was hard all of the, of the day. But uh, yeah, I'm happy about the feeling of the day and uh, it's the last race of the, of the year for me, for the season. So yeah, I'm happy about this 10th place. Super, well done. Thank you. I'm Raylan Nuss. I race for Steve Tilford Foundation Racing and I'm on Team USA. <sighs> Today was hard because there's just so much pedaling and it's so fast. Um, there's also like a couple long hills obviously on the start, but the real kicker of the course was kind of going into pit two and it was just really like heavy and your bike would kind of sink in. You had to get traction. Um, I had a crash on the end of lap two, which kind of, you know, put me back a little bit, but fought on and it was a long race today, actually. So um, yeah, it was, it was a good time just because of all the energy out on the course with all the fans and there were a lot of Americans actually out there cheering, which was kind of fun, but it was good. I don't know if you guys want to like, could kind of do like a... It was a good race, but that gap with uh, Fen Van Empel just went out quick, yeah. didn't it? It was good. We were but... a bit like, it would be interesting to know what would have happened if Puck hadn't crashed, but yeah, I don't know. I think Fen was clearly, I felt like she just woke up and was like, I'm going to be world champion today. And then she was just so focused for the entire thing. This season, whenever I didn't ride uh, World Cups, but like the Super Prestige and the X2O, my sister was also uh, riding in the race. So it's always uh, really nice yeah, being in the camper before the race with each other and uh, yeah, just uh, having a bit of fun and that uh, helps also with uh, relaxation. Thanks for watching!